everyone hope everything is going well i wanted to show this one card got this steve spurrier card through the mail he was a punter and backup quarterback as you know he coached at the university of florida won a national championship it's really nice to have in my pc and I'm trying to I'm gonna get more college quarterbacks, I mean college coaches in the future if they sign. Now, I wanted to discuss Jeff Wilson's store. Jeff Wilson, number one, he's taking a very ambitious bet, this three million dollar bet. And my own thought process is first of all, best of luck. I don't wish any ill will. However, if you're making that big of a bet in 2024, that's probably not the best idea out there. A lot of influencers won't say that. A lot of influencers were there this weekend. And they seem to have a nice time. Now, here's the story, though. 2024, in my opinion, like I've said numerous times, we will be experiencing tough economic times later this year early 2025 and you know like i said inverted yield curve is one there's issues with the money supply that decreased like crazy that's a red flag there's issues with you know gdp versus gdi a huge discrepancy i don't want to get too much into it but there's also a bunch of layoffs that i've been seeing lately now i don't think we're there yet to see the major economic problems but we will be there in my opinion and if that happens you know along with the commercial real estate market heading south this is going to be a huge problem for him in my opinion and ultimately if i were him what i would have done is wait till everything comes comes imploding and then just scoop up people's collections on the discount and then sell them later sell them piece by piece start it out small and then get big not get really big and then oh wait we're gonna be heading towards a recession that we haven't seen since 2008 a nasty one 2020 okay people managed to get back up unless they're small businesses impacted by the virus but regardless I don't think it's a good idea for that reason and also if you're starting out big, that's a red flag. You know, all these stores that have made it, they didn't start out big. They started out very small. And I get it. Jeff Wilson has backing behind him, but I don't think it's the smartest idea starting this year. If you waited, started out gradually, rather than $3 million, maybe a $100,000 investment, I think that would have been a better idea. Anyways, I want to hear your thoughts on this. Do you think that he's going to do well? Do you think that he's going to do poorly? Or it's hard to determine. Anyways, let me know and I'll talk to you later. Bye.